Hey guys, this is Ash here from the Network Studios. Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be revealing to you guys the next place for clubbing year. Now, this is hopefully going to happen if I can get a lift back, maybe even a lift there. I might be able to get there, but I think it's more getting back. So, this place is the Lodge. Now, you guys will not know, but you are actually familiar with this place if you guys have been on my channel and subscribed for a while so this place is called the lodge but it never used to be called the lodge and it used to be home to one of the best nights out i have possibly ever been to and we used to go to them quite a lot at the beginning of the clubbing year series well we went to three of them actually and i also went to about two or three last year before i even got a camera and started recording for clubbing year so this is the lodge and it sits above the arcade complex in bridlington now this place used to be a very familiar place where we used to go for clubbing year we did too funky here and um, we also did remix nights here um, which you will see a little bit later on in the video and it actually closed its doors and got a makeover to the lodge which is a bar and a restaurant and a roof terrace with a nightclub so i'm going to show you a video of what the roof the, the outdoor roof side looks like and then i'm going to come back to you tell you a bit more about it So I'm sure you guys have guessed it now, this place used to be Utopia, like I say we did all our Too Funky and Remix nights here, it used to be an absolutely amazing place and I'm thinking about going to check it out now it's changed hands. So you guys might remember an old face on our channel called Cayman Kinder, he was in our music show series and he also did some kind of behind the scenes filming for uh, for remix nights and two funky nights well mainly remix nights and um he did it at the retro night at utopia as well and um he went on the dj stage and kind of filmed the decks and some of the live artists what were there and sometimes filmed himself mixing well i'm not sure if he still works there or not if he's still a resident dj there or if he just goes and has a drink in there and a laugh because he knows the staff but i hit him up this week and asked him if he would be in there at the weekend he said he'd let me know so all being well i'm hoping to go there this weekend and we can kind of do something different than a clubbing event and kind of do a bit of a club review so there's still going to be music there's still going to be clubbing and dancing but what I'm kind of trying to say is, is it'll be a little bit different. We won't just be kind of reviewing the DJ and the night and the style of music. We'll kind of be reviewing the club as well. We'll be kind of, you know, giving our, get, sort of giving my sort of thoughts on how it is. Do I think it's, you know, now going to be a better place than when it was Utopia? And um, I'll just take a couple of videos. There won't be many videos, you know, maybe two or three videos. Um, when some of the music gets going, I'll take a few videos just, um, you know, l looking around the place. Nothing really too fancy, just so you get a little bit of a glimpse of what this place is. Nothing too spectacular. And it should work out, you know, pretty nice. So this isn't forced to happen. But I'm making the video just in case it does happen. Now you guys know that sometimes I do have clubbing events and things lined up where I fancy going to them. But it's not always a definite that I can go. But sometimes if I then find out I can go, it's sometimes a little bit too short notice for me to make the video. Bearing in mind that I might not you know, know that I'm definitely going until saturday if that makes sense and it's a little bit of short notice to make a video about it 
So, if I make the video a few days in advance, if I do end up going, then I already have the video recorded and uploaded. You know, you guys know where we're going and, you know, when I record the videos there. And if I don't go, then I'll just make another video explaining that I um, obviously couldn't go. But I personally think we will be going. Like I say, it's mainly if he's going to be there, Cayman Kinder. And it's also if I can get a lift back. Now, a lift back, I used to get lifts back, but... I don't know if I'll be able to get one back this time or not. And obviously at 3 a.m. Um, you're hardly going to be able to catch a bus um, or a train. Plus I'm going to have had a you know a skin full probably. Well, you know, I'll have had a few drinks. I'll be ready to just get a lift home and get into bed. But I think, you know, this thing could possibly happen. Uh, this thing could go ahead. I'm looking forward to trying it. And uh, it's something new for clubbing year. So please like, subscribe and comment. We shall see you guys in the next video.